वर्टीन्स July 2020 Whoever does the will of my father in heaven is my brother and sister and mother Matthew chapter 12 verse 50 Matthew's gospel recounts an episode in Jesus's life Let's imagine we are in Capernaum and Jesus's mother and relatives came to meet him while he was still speaking to the crowds his mother and his brothers appeared outside wishing to speak with him someone told him your mother and your brothers are standing outside asking to speak with you but he said in reply to the one who told him who is my mother who are my brothers and stretching out his hand towards his disciples he said you are my mother and my brothers for whoever does the will of my heavenly father is my brother and sister and mother jesus revealed something really new He said that anyone can be a part of his family as long as they are committed to knowing and doing the will of God who is our father. Anyone an adult or child, man or woman, healthy or sick, from every culture or social position, anyone because everyone is made in the image of god who is love in fact every person on earth can have a personal relationship with god we can all get to know him and become his friend do you want to be his friend doing the will of god means loving god and loving other people anyone can do that and when we love others jesus recognizes us as a part of his family he considers us his brothers and sisters this is such an amazing gift we are free of anything that had happened in the past free from any fears we might have free from our own way of seeing things even our limitations and weaknesses can be launching pads that propel us towards true fulfillment our whole life takes a huge leap in quality kiara lubek invited people who want to live this word of life to be a family be a family are there people among you who are suffering spiritual or moral trials understand them like a mother would and even more enlighten them through your words or example don't let them lack the warmth of the family but rather increase it Are there people among you who are suffering physically? They should be your favorite brothers or sisters. Never put any activity of any kind before the spirit of being a family with those you are living with. And wherever you go, do bring the love of Christ. The best thing you can do is to try to create discreetly and with prudence. but also with firm conviction the spirit of a family it is a humble spirit it wishes the best for everyone it is not proud it is true charity experiences from around the world 
in one neighborhood in the city of Hims in Syria more than 150 children most of whom are muslims attend an after school program sponsored by members of the greek orthodox church sandra is the director and told us we try to make them feel welcome and help them with our team of teachers and specialists we always try to create the sense of being one family based on dialogue and promoting good values many of these children have been traumatized and have suffered a lot we want to help them build up their self esteem and trust others again most of their families have been separated from each other due to the war but here they find the desire to start over again now we would like to invite you to take a moment and reflect on these points What are you waiting for? Let's start living the world.